This video will show you how to put a logo on your receipt and maybe modify some of the small print or something else about the receipt. To do that, just click on print and click on modify reports. You can see that it's checked because if I go back to print and you see modify reports has a checkbox next to it. So now any report that I see, it will show me the modification portion of the report instead of the real report. For example, if I go to file transactions and click on preview here, you see the modify report screen. Now if I want to put a logo on here, I'll go to report, insert control, picture. I'll click on the three little dots next to file called the ellipsis and find where my pictures are stored. I can find them if I go to computer, C drive, the Arate folder. Of course your pictures might be somewhere else on your hard drive. Uh, mine's in the sample data, pictures, and here's an Arch logo right here. So I'm just going to double click on it and remember to click on scale picture retain shape. And then I'm going to click OK. It appears in the top left hand corner really small. So just like uh, I resize a window, I'm going to grab on the lower right hand corner and just kind of stretch it out. And then I'm going to move it by clicking anywhere in the middle and dragging it to wherever I want it to go. I'm going to put it right here. Now if I right click in a blank spot somewhere, I'm going to go to print preview and it's going to show me what it looks like. Um, let's say I want to move that a little bit more to the left. I'm going to close this using the bottom X in the top right hand corner and I can use the arrows on my keyboard to move it just a little bit or I can drag it over. Then if I right click again, do preview, that looks good. Now let's say I wanted to change some of the small print on the bottom. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to double click on this one right here. Then I'm going to click on the ellipsis again and you can see how the words are in here and it's in between some quotation marks. So if I wanted to change to what something I wanted to say, I'm just going to type it in this box here and make sure that I keep it in the quotation marks. When I'm done, I'm just going to hit OK and then OK again and you can see that it's changed here. So if I right click again on a blank spot and go to print preview and scroll down, you can see that it changed. Now let's say I wanted to add or I wanted to change the font color. I'm going to click on it one time so that it's selected, go to format and then go to font. Here I can change the size, the color, uh, let's make it red, and maybe the font type. Let's say I want to change it to, that looks good, and then just hit OK. And you can see that it's changed. Now remember this is a template, so this is going to be this way for all my receipts. So if I right click again and do a print preview, you can see how it's changed. And then I'm going to close it again. And I would do that to the same for all the stuff that I want to change in terms of font and size and color and stuff like that. Uh, to save it, I'm just going to click on the top right hand corner X, the bottom one, because you see how there's two of them. I'm going to click on this and it's going to say, do you want to save changes? I'm going to click on yes. And then I got to make sure I turn modify reports off. So I'm going to click on that again. And if I do a preview now, that's how my template looks.